today you have joined with the very first video of our scratch video series. With this we are going to learn how to download the scratch offline editor into our computer. Alright my kids, let's get started. As the very first step, y'all can open your favorite web browser. So as usual, I'm going to open my Google Chrome. So in the search bar, you have to type Scratch Offline Editor Download. So it suggests me the word here. So I'm going to click and open it. So you can see the very first website on my screen. So this will be the original website where you need to use when you are downloading Scratch to your computer. So this will be a small tip for you. Before you download Scratch Offline Editor, double check whether you are using the correct URL. That means the correct web address. So let's see what are the next steps. Here they are suggesting me some operating systems. But on the bottom of the screen, they have already selected my current operating system. So normally when you open it, automatically they will suggest you this. So if you are using any other kind of operating systems such as Mac OS or else Android or any other thing, you all can simply click on them and select them, right? Here you can see they are giving me two options to download Scratch from the Microsoft Store and the second option is to download it directly. I'm going to use the direct option, okay? So as you can see, once after I click the download, automatically they will display you the downloading process on the bottom of your screen. So this will take around few seconds. So once after they finish the downloading process, you can see the scratch icon has become yellow, okay? At that time, you can simply click on your file and open it. Now we are going to start the installing process. Right, I'll minimize it. So at this step, you all need to select one option from this. Okay, if any other users are there in the computer, you can give the first option. Or else if you are using Scratch, you can simply give only for me. Okay, so I'm going to continue with only for me. And then you can click on the install button so once after you finish your installing process they will automatically put a shortcut for your scratch offline editor so once after you see your icon on the desktop you can simply click the finish button okay so here also they are asking you to select one among these two options right so I'm not going to select any, right? So that I'll uh, select the blue area so that I can continue my work. Right, so it's very simple to download your offline scratch editor. So from next week, we are going to continue small projects in scratch. So don't miss out any video. Stay tuned with us. So see you with the next video soon. Thank you very much.